الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين سيدنا ومولانا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه المعين أما بعد عن أنس رضي الله تعالى عنه قال قال رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يا بني إن قدرت أن تصبح وتمسع وليس في قلبك غش لأحد فخل ثم قال لي يا بني وذلك من سنتي ومن أحب سنتي فقد أحبني ومن أحبني كان معي في الجنة أو كما قال النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم رواه الترمذي On the thirty of Anas bin Malik, may God be pleased with him, he said, The Holy Messenger of Allah, may peace and mercy of Allah be upon him, he said, O my son, if you are capable of waking up in morning and ending of evening and you have nothing in your heart of deception to any other. And he said, Oh my son, this is of my sunnah. And who loved my sunnah, then he loved me. And who loved me with me in paradise at the day of resurrection. Respected viewers, Anas bin Malik is a famous companion of the Holy Prophet, peace upon him, and he lived in his service for ten years. One day, the Holy Prophet, peace upon him, said to him, O oh my son, if you are capable of waking up in the morning and ending of evening, and you have nothing in your heart of deception, then do this. It means the Holy Prophet peace upon him said to him that this is my sunnah, that your heart is clean from deception, grudge, hatred, and ill thinking, etc. This is my sunnah, and whoever loves my sunnah as he loves me, and who loves me will be with me in the paradise at the day of resurrection. Respected viewers, look what is the great reward for a faithful believer who loves the Sunnah of Holy Prophet and he has a clean heart because if heart is clean from deception, grudge and ill thinking, hatred, etc. or any diseases, then this heart will reflect the inspiration from divine. And on, on the other hand, if his heart is dirty by committing sins, hatred, etc., then it reflects the whispering from Shatta that will lead him astray. So most respected viewers, it is necessary that a faithful believer should have love and affection from to other people, to other faithful believers, and should not have the grudge, hatred, etc. So that he may get the company of Holy Prophet, peace upon him in paradise as a day of resurrection. Respected viewers, 
This is the teaching of Islam that a faithful believer should have clean heart. And if there is any dispute stands between two faithful believers, then he should say to him, Brother, I have noticed such and such in you. Please clear it. And if I am at fault, then pardon me. And he should not put anything in his heart. This is the Sunnah for the Prophet. May Allah Almighty give us the feet of the soul. Amin. Amalina. Idar Brahma. Amin.